Welcome to the Geek Delegation Breakdown. I'm Dan Page, and I'm also fucking speechless. Anyone who knows me knows my love for the old Konami Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles arcade games. And today, Tribute Games, in association with Nickelodeon, announced a brand new 16-bit beat-em-up Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game called Shredder's Revenge. They released an awesome trailer with the full original cartoon theme song done by Mike Patton, who you might know from Faith No More and Mr. Bungle. Before we even get into it, I want to share this photo of my daughter Madison because this picture captures exactly what my face looked like when I was staring at the screen earlier today when this trailer popped up. To understand where we're going though, we gotta look to the past. And that past starts in 1989 with the original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles arcade game. Now I've made it no secret that this is probably the most influential game in my entire life. Bar none. In my eyes, this game was perfect. Amazing music, amazing visuals, and when my dad would bring me to Fun Inn at Fashion Plaza Mall in North Brunswick, New Jersey, he would have to rapid fire quarters at me just so I would stop crying every time I got shell shocked. I even bought the arcade 1UP re-release that came out in 2019 for my daughters because I really wanted them to experience what the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game was and they loved it. They loved the colors, they loved the so late 80s digitized voices. <laughs> And then from there was Turtles in Time, which was another amazing game. This one actually had a near picture-perfect port on the Super Nintendo, and me and my cousins would play it every weekend. The formula would get repeated for years on home consoles and in arcades. You had the Hyperstone Heist for Sega Genesis, the Manhattan Project for NES, and there was even a few attempts with the GameCube, PlayStation, cell shading 3D era with the 2003 cartoon. And there was a whole bunch of other iterations. But this one? This one feels different. This one feels special. If you're not familiar with Tribute Games, they were the ones behind the Scott Pilgrim vs. The World the game, which was absolutely phenomenal. And that gives me hope that this is going to be the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game that we waited 32 years for. Not saying that we haven't had some good ones in the meantime, but I'm hoping this is the big one. We don't have a release date yet, but we've been promised an iconic tour of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle locations. So one can only assume that we're going to get the New York City streets, the sewers, the Technodrome, and it also appears we're getting the classic Rogues Gallery. So Shredder, Bebop, Rocksteady, look like they're all coming along for this ride. So if you're wondering if I'm excited for this, Hell yes I am, and I can't wait for more information to drop on it. But as soon as it does, you know I'll be on top of it right over here at the Geek Delegation. So follow me over on YouTube, follow me over on Twitch, and have an awesome, awesome day full of turtle power. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles.